But hey, I mean hey, look at this, 14 freaking up Nixalai with the rebel rousing and everything. It is so darn freaking delicious. What up brothers and sisters and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Match Malone. Thank you all so very freaking much for tuning in. I hope you're having a wonderful freaking Friday. TGIF, my friends. TGIF. So yeah, it is finally Friday. But before we get into the craziest freaking deck that I have built in the whole season, Justin LeShore, thank you so very freaking much for becoming a gold span dragon. And if you are French by any chance, Justin Lassure, Merci beaucoup. If you aren't, well, here you heard me say something in French, so pardon my French. But enough with the yammering. Let's get into the crazy combo hammering. Don't get distracted by these beautiful sleeves. They weren't on the deck yet when I was doing the video. Because I was doing the video yesterday, doing the deck tech today. Because yesterday I just had no more time to do it. So, what do we want to do? As you can see, the deck is called All the Ops. And people have been trying to copy up Nixalay a lot, you know, they just, I don't know, brought down a a, 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 a cat wagon, you know, the Cadillac, the Meow, see in his pants, and copy to copy. But hey, that ain't enough for me, you know, one copy each turn, that is rookie numbers, my friends. We're making ourselves infinite freaking up Nixalay. All we have to do is to attack in with some creatures and bam. So what is the idea? Well... The idea is a little convoluted here, <laughs> so let's get it all down. First of all, we need the Luxior Giada's Gift and an Upnixalite copy. We cannot have the original, we need the copy, because we need something that is not freaking legendary. Then we put the Luxior onto the copy, so that now it is a creature. Now we attack in with the Rebel Rousing and some more creatures that we have, courtesy of Sunset Reverie, the Shambly Boy, the Wandering Emperor, we have the Obnixila itself that can make us creatures. So yeah, that is already exactly what we need to do. Now we get like three to four creatures, and that is all right. We still have not, maybe the Opnix lies still on the battlefield as not as a creature. So now we have 4 to 5 creatures on the battlefield. That's okay. The next turn, we attack in with like, let's say, 7 creatures plus the Opnix lie. And we use a freaking Mystic Reflection. Oh my lord. You choose a target, non legendary creature. In that case, it is our Opnixilis. It is our Opnixilis copy that is not legendary. That is a creature thanks to the Luxior. And now the next time one or more creatures or planeswalkers enter the battlefield this turn, they enter as a copy of the chosen creature. As we have chosen the Opnixilis. Now when we attack in, and all of these are made at the same time, that is the most important part. If only one creature gets in one after another, that doesn't count. They have to come in at the same time. Now five or six or seven creatures get in, maybe you have three to five rebel rousing out. It is just obscene. All of them will come in as an Obnixili freaking token. Yes, my friend. All of them as a freaking token of the Obnixili. Not as a creature though, because they are not equipped with the Luxior. They will come in as fresh new Obnixili. So that is how, my friends, with only four cards, you can come into the possession of 14 Obnixili in one single turn. And it is pretty darn amazing. Because let's be honest, if you have 14 of Nyx alive, now you're dealing 28 damage. That is pretty darn good. <laughs> and oh my lord, it is so freaking fun. And the deck itself is not even half that bad, because it needs to be good to survive until we can get to this point. That is why we have the Shamley Boy together with the Deadly Dispute and the Sunset Reverie. We have some early creatures and some life gain and some card draw. We have some card draw with the big score as well. We have the March of the Red Sorrow to survive until we can get our combo online. And we do have the Meadog Massacre and the Doomscore as Sport Wipes. And of course the Wandering Freaking Emperor as, you know, token creation. But you can also exile a creature, just to survive a little bit. You know, that is also something you can do. So yeah, but what we want to do actually is to, you know, just rabble rousing and with the Mystic Reflection get ourselves a bajillion freaking up Nixalai. There is other ways you could do this. There is other ways. You could also go with green as well instead of white and, uh, you know, use something else. 
but I don't know, man. We don't have these many big creatures. So if you're using the tent to pass or whatever it's called, maybe you're getting only two to three creatures. That ain't enough for me. That just ain't enough for me. I want them all. I want all the Opnixili in one singular freaking turn. Landwise, we have three beautiful, beautiful plains by Rosemary Valerie O'Connell. We have one beautiful island by Andy Williams. We have one beautiful swamp by Mr. Misang and one beautiful uh, mountain by Yume. Then we have two deserted beach, two blight step pathway, two hundred ridge, two needle verge pathway, two sundown pass, and four towers and lounges because those can be cycled. So, and we need all the freaking lands we can get to make certain that we always have the mana that we freaking need. This deck is bananas. It is literally freaking bananas, my friend. So I hope that you will enjoy the jankiest, most craziest, still winning kind of games kind of deck that I have ever created. So thank you all so very freaking much once more. I wish you all a beautiful freaking Friday starting to the weekend. Enjoy the Pokemon World Championship if you are into that stuff. I'm Max Malone and I will see you in those janky games. This might be the most convoluted deck that I have ever played in my entire life. We cannot keep this hand, sadly. Can't keep this hand, though. Even though it's had no black in it yet. But we might freaking find it. So, we were trying here. We tried. Is there no sound? Oh, there's the black now. There's the black now. Well, it doesn't really matter. We're up against enchantments here anyways. Or humans. Oh no, even more freaking terrible. Even more freaking terrible. Oh baby, it's going to be bad. It's going to be real freaking bad. So we really need a board wipe here. That is the only thing that can save us. For the rest, we're looking pretty darn bad here against this deck. Um, okay, it's getting worse and worse. <laughs> it's, it's just getting worse and worse. I do not like it one bit. Not in the freaking slightest. So... Okay, all right, now we're not doing it. I will sadly have to sacrifice the Luxior here and hopefully find something amusing. That is the only thing we can do. It's the only way out because we don't have one of our seven board wipes. It's only six, but it's still six board wipes. You know, there's 10% chance finding it. Okay, all right, they're uh, going uh, pretty darn ham here right away. We might be dead already. There's a high chance that we are dead already. That is 11 damage coming our freaking way. That is just 11 damage coming our freaking way. Okay, here it is. 11 freaking damage. Okay. And alrighty. So we're dead next turn until unless we find the perfect answer off the top here. If we do find the perfect answer off the top, hey, we have a small and significant chance. If we don't, we're just super screwed. We didn't. Of course we did. <laughs> We're just super freaking screwed. All right. <laughs> okay. I mean, hey, we still have a small and significant chance here. You know, we're going back to 11 here. So, hey, maybe we do find something, you know. And uh, as we uh, are losing here anyways, like one of these creatures, we could also turn it into one of our uh, little devils here. And get into more life. Because why the heck not, you know? Why the freaking heck not? All right, they still have stuff. I bet they have another wild shape. Like, let's be honest. Let's be freaking honest. They never not have two wild shapes. That is just the name of the game, you know? Just the name of the freaking game. All right, and we will see what they're doing, though. They're going for the face, you know? We can still play the rebel rousing and hopefully get something a meowsing. That would be pretty darn good. Pretty darn freaking take. If they're just going for the, um, for the Obnixili here, I will totally... Freaking let them do that. Yep, so freaking lootly. Yes, I will. I would, as I said, not be surprised if they just have another wild shape. I told you. I, I freaking told you. I would not be surprised in the slightest. Not in the slightest. If they just had another freaking wild shape here. I mean, hey. <laughs> Perfectly fine. Nothing to see here, you know? Nothing at all. Okay. Are you going for the face here? You have a third wild shape. Do you freaking have it? If they, as I said, if they're going for the Obnixili here, I'm absolutely okay with that. Absolutely, freaking lootly We're doubly going for the Obnixili. We will have to see. Because the thing is, if they don't have another Wild Shape in hand, we're not even looking half that badge, you know? Not even half that freaking badge. Okay. We will block here. Of 
because the life gain is a little bit more important. And painful. So what you doing now? The big score. Well, that ain't doing it for me. I need to go with the rebel rouse in here and uh, make myself a little blocker. Another sunset revelry is not exactly what we're looking for here. So, this turn it will absolutely go for uh, my face here. But I will just block, you know? And I do have another rebel rousing, so as long as you don't have another wild shape, we're kind of fine. Kind of fine. Okay. Annoying as heck. Does this get trampled? No, it doesn't. It does not get trampled. Alright, we will see what you're doing here. What are you learning, my friend? What are you freaking learning? I hope it is something amazing. So... The containment breach! Are you kidding me, man? Are you freaking kidding me, man? Okay, they are freaking kidding me. A containment freaking breach. Get out of here, game. Get out of here! Good thing we have another rebel rousing, though. Good thing we have it. Because they're all out of uh, wild shapes, you know? They might have some more in their deck, but that is kind of it. No blockage here. So, that is alright. We're gaining ourselves a lot of freaking creatures here now. And I like that a lot. So, we also have the Refined Tower for afterwards if we really freaking need it. Oh, the Mystic Reflection might be very darn good. But I'd rather have the Deadly Dispute once more. Okay, we're getting in there, making ourselves two blockers. Very darn nice. And uh, maybe we're just blocking one of these suckers. Maybe we are, because, uh, you know, the more creatures we have, the better. The freaking better. So, my friend, what is your grand freaking scheme here? Do you have another wild shape? So we have to block one of these suckers, and we're blocking the one with the most damage here. This is eight. If they do have another wild shape, okay, they don't. They don't have another wild shape. That is beautiful. So we're getting three blockers out of this, and that is just very darn nice. Another dragon star elite. Okay, we're still getting three blockers out of this. So, uh, we'll be keeping this one because you never know, maybe we would need it for something better. Okay. Well, that is just darn freaking amazing, isn't it? We'll be attacking him with these. All of them. Freaking all of them. We're blocking the little devil with their Dragon Scar Elite. Okay, that is super fine. Because we will now shoot the Dragon Scar Elite and they think, hey, we're super safe because we have like a, um, a protection here. But you don't, my friend, you don't. Okay, all I need to do. There you go. There you freaking go. Alrighty. So we can do it for uh, three, actually. And that is pretty darn freaking tasty. So we're going back to 9 here, which is super darn good. And uh, next turn we can all come in as Illuminator Virtuosos. <laughs> and that is already pretty darn good, I have to say. That is already pretty darn freaking good. So, do you have your third wild shape in hand, my friend? You do not. You do freaking not. Okay. We're doing it right away. Let us see what they have. If they do have something here. They don't have anything. <laughs> so now check our freaking uh, 10 Illuminator Virtuosos that we have on the battlefield. Ain't that freaking beautiful? Oh, the answer is yes, it is. Yes, it freaking is beautiful. Nice. Thanks, my friend. Thank you very freaking much. Thank you so very freaking much. I also think it is nice. And as you didn't have anything before, you don't have anything now. So let's just get rid of this sucker. Let's just get rid of it right freaking away. Oh, I mean, it wasn't Infinite of Nick's Life, but it was Infinite freaking Illuminator Virtuoso. With a little help from a friend here. Oh, my lord, you don't have anything. Good game, good game, my friend. Get out of here. It started so well for you. But in the end, it didn't even matter. In the end, it did not even freaking matter. Okay, another Refined Tower into Refined Tower into a Refined Tower. Nope, there is the Obnixili now. Oh, sadly we couldn't do it already. Sadly we could not do it yet. But hey, we're still attacking in with a lot of freaking Illuminator Virtuosos here. Courtesy of our opponent. Get 
out of here. Get out of here. That was a very darn good use for the mystical reflection, I have to say. Crazy guy and a bag. In a bag or with with a bag? I, I don't care. I don't care. All right. So, they're going first. That means they're Boros, even though they have these sleeves, but they cannot fool me, you know? I invented the fooling people by sleeves deck. Oh, okay. They're mono black. Oh, my lord. Okay. Here goes our Meadog Massacre. Here it freaking goes. I think it is our Meadog Massacre. I don't think it will be the Sunset Reverie. It is the Sunset Reverie. Okay. Interesting. Pretty darn interesting. I still have the Meadog Massacre, so I'm still alrighty. Do you have another one of those, though? Do you have it? The Null Priest of Oblivion. Okay. That is A-OK -okay with me. We just bring down the Obnixili here and we're kind of fine. Kind of freaking fine. For now. Okay, here is the Sunset Reverie. That is even better. That is even freaking better. I mean, we're not getting a freaking uh, land out of this. A freaking card out of this, which is a little bit terrible. But we are getting our Deadly Dispute. We're getting the Obnixili. So, A.O. I'm still okay with this, you know. I am still absolutely okay with this. All right. The March of the Otherworldly. Okay, yeah, you go ahead and do that, my friend. You go ahead and freaking do that. No worries at all. I couldn't care less. Losing two life here is like nothing to me. Freaking nothing. This is so darn good. All right, here comes the Upnix alive. And we are second in this. Like, give me one darn good. And yes, we will lose one of our Abnixili. But that is still alright, because the thing is, if they do uh, use the, um, the uh, Invoke Despair before, we're still kind of fine, you know? But right now we're not doing what I wanted to do, but we're still okay. We are still absolutely okay. And we still do have the Meat of Massacre. But here comes, here comes the thing, I'm pretty darn certain. Okay? It doesn't. All right, but still, if they do, they use, they lose this their enough Priest of Oblivion. Over. And I do have the big score still. The Soul Shatter. Oh no, the horror. The horror. Okay, Xander's Lounge. That is pretty darn nice. I like it. And we're chilling now. Yes, I will just sacrifice my deadly dispute and my little devil here on the Null Priest of Oblivion. All right, are you attacking in? You are. I mean, you know about my deadly dispute, don't you, my friend? You know about that. But I really wonder why you did this. I really wonder why. Do you have your own deadly dispute? Do you have it? You do. Okay. That's just beautiful, isn't it? So, here it goes. We're drawing two, they're drawing two. Okay. But it is our turn, so I'm still okay with everything that's happening. I will go ahead and draw myself another deadly dispute. Yes. Yes, I will use it here to sacrifice this little treasure. And I mean, I do have the March of the Rat Sorrow, so I really don't care, you know? Uh, the March of the... I do have the Meadog Massacre. So I can just go ahead, Meadog Massacre away, my friends, and be freaking happy about it. Unless they have another deadly dispute. But hey, if they do, it is just what it is. I will keep this Refined Tower as a cycle. Because, you know, there's never only one. There is never only one. Okay, here comes the Meadog. Oh, they do have another deadly dispute. Ain't that freaking beautiful? Ain't it freaking beautiful? Maybe they also have, like, another uh, Soul Shadow or March of the Red Sorrow. You never know. So, we only need one of our cards and we're super darn happy. All right, for telling this now. And then we can still, uh, you know, get rid of the other one with the big score. If we even do that. If we even freaking do that. Now I think we're cycling it like this. I mean, it will draw us another one. Oh, it's a rebel rousing. It is a rebel freaking rousing. Let's use that right away. I like that. I really do. We're getting ourselves, yes, the Opnixili. That is super good. <clears throat> and we're chilling. And we're freaking chilling. I need this Xander's Lounge to sacrifice to the big score. That is what I want to do here. So, our plan has come together. <coughs> I need to cough uh, far, far away. I need to cough. Okay. The Luxurious Gift, that is also pretty darn good and exactly what I want here. And we're chilling now. 
One, two, three, four, one, two, three. I will have enough for my Wandering Emperor, which is super good. So our opponent's on 10 lands and 18. That hurts. That hurts. Not gonna lie, that hurts a lot. All right, but we are as well. So a, <laughs> so a. <laughs> no worries here at all. None so we ever. But they don't have anything here. At least it looks like they don't have anything. And we will just see what they're doing here. Keep watch so, for intruders. what is your grand freaking scheme, my friend? What is it? Do you have another uh, soul shatter? Do you have another march of the red sorrow? Whatever it is, go ahead, show me, freaking show me. I don't mind. I would just uh, okay. They do have another march of the red sorrow. Ain't that freaking beautiful? Well, it does not really matter too much to me. They're down to one singular card. One singular freaking card. I will use this right away. There's literally no reason not to, because maybe we do find two more lands. That is exactly what I was about to say. Maybe we do find two more lands, you know? And then that's good. <laughs> oh, game. You're so beautiful sometimes. So beautiful. So we discarded, what, one, two, three lands already. We have two in hand, that makes five. So we're on uh, 12 lands in the first 18. Yes, yes. And a scoop. Okay. <laughs> there was no reason to scoop here, my friend. I had nothing. I had a handful of lands. Get out of here. Alrighty. So things are going Okay, I mean, hey, we're up against Fred's favorite. We're going first. I love it. I really do. I mean, all we need is one singular land, and we're good, you know? We're freaking good. If we can find one land, I can only repeat, we're good. <laughs> all right. We're up against enchantments, eh? Otherwise, they would be playing snow. I told you we are. I told you we are. Okay. It's still all right, you know, as long as you find one land once more, we're kind of super fine. Kind of super freaking fine. Okay, right now I'm not looking too happy here. Yeah, you can have it. You can't freaking have it. Alrighty, I like it. So, um, thing being we're doing this now. We're drawing cards, gaining life, making ourselves two creatures, bringing down the looks you are here. And that next turn we could even go with the uh, with the freaking Meatog Masker here, but I'd rather play the Obnixili to be honest. Or do I? I mean, hey, you know, they're attacking in here. Oh no, the Generous Visitore. That ain't bueno. That ain't bueno at all. Okay. So in that case we're doing this. Bringing down the Obnixili, yes. Uh, getting rid of the Shamley boy. We are getting rid of the generous visitor here. Please don't have the thing I fear the most. Please don't have the thing I fear the most. They don't have the thing I fear the most. Beautiful. Freaking beautiful. Alright. So. Now all we need. All we need now is the one little thing. That one little thing that I wanted the most. Oh my lord, they're missing white. Okay. I don't, I don't mind at all. You can miss white as much as you want. And uh, we can do the Midog Masker. Why does nobody let me play my game, man? We were so close. We only needed the Mystic Reflect. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, I don't want to go to Sparky to show it off. Get out of here. If this goes on like this. Oh, Manfred. If this goes on like this, I really have to beat up Sparky. And then Sparky is like... It's not even my fault, you know? It will not even be my freaking fault if Sparky gets beaten up. Not in the slightest. So, am I bringing down the Luxure here? I think I am. Like, what am I afraid of here? A lot of things. Like, what is a person like Manfred playing? Let's give him a friendly waiver of the hand. Hello! Oh, the Boros. Okay. They're just freaking Boros. I mean, hey, what am I supposed to do about that now? So we're still bringing down the Shambly Boy and the Luxure here. I mean, we do have the March of the Red Sorrow, so that is still okay, you know. We can still get rid of stuff. We just need to find that stuff. I told you there, Boros. Oh, ain't that beautiful. Ain't that freaking beautiful. Okay, I hope they're pumping up their own Luminarch. Okay, they are. They freaking are. That is beautiful. I love it. I really do. Okay. 
And we're chilling here. Oh, it is one land or them attacking in. Both would be equally as good. Equally as good. Because then we can play the big score, you know, and all of the shebang. Kumano faces Kakasan. Okay, that is absolutely alright. Absolutely still alright with me. So I don't think that we will be attacking in here, let's be honest. We have a second Luminar. Oh, get out of here, game. No. No, 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 no. Alright, they're pumping this one up. They're pumping this one up. So we can uh, destroy this one. Gain some life. That is beautiful. I like it. I really do. And now they will be attacking in. One bajillion percent. Oh. Like, super serial here. They don't. They freaking don't attack in. Oh my lord. Okay. I mean, hey, they will be attacking in afterwards. That much I can tell you. That much I can tell you. This is so bad, us not finding a land here. Okay, this is good though. This is real darn good though. Uh, we're making a treasure. Now they will be just attacking in, which is super good. I love it, I really do. They're not doing anything else. That is still alright, you know? That is still absolutely alright, because we do have the Wandering Emperor here. And maybe we can find a board wipe. I mean, they're, uh, they're afraid of a board wipe here. They pretty much are. We're still not finding land that is so freaking bad, man. Like, there is no words but freaking bad that we aren't finding, like, stuck on three lands against Boros. Oh, my lord. Yeah. That ain't good at all, my friends. Just ain't freaking good at all. The Thundering Raiju now even, of all things unholy. Of all the things unholy, now they even have a freaking Thundering Raiju. Ain't it freaking beautiful? The answer is no. No, it ain't. So they're getting in here for, uh, yeah. A lot of freaking damage. And we're not finding land. We're not finding anything here. Is our doom here, my friends. Our freaking doom. Okay. Can we get rid of the Thundering Raiju and then maybe be happy with our lives? I don't know. Finally, I'm home. we can. I'm still taking the damage. Brutal, man. Brutal. Okay. <laughs> now we found the land. Now we freaking found the land. A little late, game. A little late. I have to say that is just a little bit late. Just a little bit, you know. Just a freaking little bit late. Okay. I have got no and, um... Teach you. Bringing down the red source, it does not even really matter. We're dead here anyways. They, uh, they have exact lethal. Which is super darn brutal. Super darn brutal, not gonna lie. I, I really hate it. I really do hate it. We do have one small, insignificant chance here of winning. One small, insignificant chance of not winning, but uh, maybe turning this around, you know? As to blocks, we're blocking here like this. Good gaming me already? Okay, yeah, you do that. You good game me already, my friend. Go ahead and good game me already. There's no problem here. Maybe we do find something beautiful. The Meadog Masker, oh my lord. One too late, oh my lord. This is so, mm, oh, Poros, I hate you so much. If only we had to hand one land, one turn sooner. We could have like big scored, draw ourselves some things and get into the Meadog Masker a little bit sooner. This was brutal, man, brutal. It happens so often that I go up against Boros and lose because I don't find the land in time, man. So often. It is insanity, man. It is freaking insanity. Alright. So, once more we're second, which means that we're up against Boros. <laughs> I'm not even kidding when I say these things. You know that. You know that I'm not kidding. And here it comes, the white source right away, or a red source, it, yep, yep, I told you, I freaking told you. Well, this time we do have a Doom Scar. Beautiful game, freaking beautiful, thank you so much, I appreciate it thoroughly, I really freaking do. Alright, that is peculiar, I have to say, that really is peculiar. Okay, so yeah, we're chilling here, I mean we're attacking and there's literally no reason not to. They might have the, um... The, uh, they might play a rat here into the, uh, the, 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 the knight. Oh, they're just enchantment. Okay. Well, I can live with that. I really can. And we're bringing down the, uh, the uh, Luxurious Gift here. And, uh... Oh, it is Giada's Gift. And attack in. I mean, once more, we do have the Doomscar here, so I'm not too afraid. 
a little bit still, but uh, hey, we are, we have like one of the things we need already, you know? One of the things we need is already here. The Weaver of Harmony, okay. I don't, I don't care about that too much. Once more, I do have the freaking Doomscar here. And I'm not afraid to use it. Uh, we're creating a treasure. Yes, yes, yes. Now, what else would I create here? Oh my lord, two lands, really game. Is this a joke? Is this a joke? Like, remember last game? Remember last freaking game? Where all we needed was one singular freaking land to be happy with our lives. And now look at us, drawing two lands in a row on six lands in the same amount of time we were there before. That is just bananas. Okay, am I doing this even now? Am I even doing this now? No, I don't think I am. I will be second one of the treasures to draw myself more cards. That is what I want to do. And maybe I'll find another creature. That would be pretty darn nice. Pretty darn freaking nice. The Faithbound Judge! I like that a lot. I really do. I really freaking do. Okay, and we're second this little treasure here. Okay, more freaking land. Chef's Kiss Delicious game. Chef's freaking kiss delicious. Alright, so we're second the looks you're here. There's literally no reason not to. The Sunset Reverie is pretty darn nice, I have to say. It gives us creatures. And these creatures give us a freaking Opnixilai, which is also pretty darn freaking tasty. Okay, good, good. So, we got the Opnixilai now. I hope they don't have another Faithbound Judge. That would be a little bit weird. Not only a little bit. Uh, Faithbound Judge one can one also one not one attack in, so yeah. Fine. Go ahead and do your thing, my friend. Go ahead and do your thing. Okay. So, it needs what? Three? Yeah, three. Okay. Alright. Borrowed time. Oh my lord. Take the original. Take the original. Come on, man. Why didn't you How take the original? That is so saddening. Built. That is so darn saddening. Oh gosh. Oh no. Okay. But I will not destroy this Faithbound Judge until we're like a little bit further, you know? We're still like on our way to glory. Like we're still there, you know? We just need another Opnix line now. <laughs> just need another one of those. Which we might fight, you know? The Rebel Rousing now, that is just freaking beautiful. Just freaking beautiful. Okay, let us do this first. See what they're doing. <laughs> Are we Rebel Rousing? What do we get here? Another up Nixalite. That is exactly what I want here. Freaking exactly what I want here. This needs three, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Good, good. I mean, we're still trying to do our work here. We're still trying to do our darndest. And if we can, that would be pretty darn freaking tasty. Okay. Do you have another borrowed time, though? Do you hear it? Do you freaking hear it? I hope they don't. We still make them discard stuff. We still attack him with our Obnixili, maybe. Do we? Do we? No, I don't think we do. Okay, opponent's not doing anything. I like it, I really do. Um, let's do this first. <laughs> Your punishment now we are attacking him with everything once more. The ones that they're blocking will be the one that I will just sacrifice to the deadly dispute. And hopefully... Hopefully we do something else than just win by Meat of Masker. But if I have to win by Meat of Masker, I will totally freaking do it. Totally freaking I do it, my friends. Oh, where's the things I want, game? Where's the things I want? I want my thanks. I do want my thanks. So please give me my thanks. I have all the mana. I have everything. I have an Obnixili below there. That is so darn good. So all we've got to do now is to bring the Luxior onto our Obnixili so they cannot attack it anymore. And I really want to do that. I really do. And then maybe, maybe, one day, we might do amazing freaking things. Who knows? We're still pretty darn close to it, you know? Still pretty darn close to doing it. So now they can attack in. All we need is to find the one card. The one singular card, you know? They wipe the board here, I will be very sad. Are you wiping the board? You are wiping the board. Oh my lord, the mad lad. The freaking mad lad. Are you seriously wiping the board here? Are you now? 
Do you have a Doom Scar? Oh, it has Vigilance. That is why. Okay. I mean, hey, let's cycle first, see what we can find here. Using our Obnixilla is like totally okay with me. It's another layer. Okay. Now we do get it. Oh no, now, game, you piece of trash. <laughs> Now we do get it! Oh my lord! That is so brutal, man! Now we got two of them! Freaking two of them! Oh my gosh! Oh my sweet lord! Okay, I mean, hey, we got two of those! That is all I wanted! All I freaking wanted was this, you know? All I wanted was this! Okay, I mean, we are still alive here, you know? We're still kinda good! The Wandering Emperor is super darn good here! Super darn good! Because that means that we can... Uh, wait, am I already... Uh, I'm already in my hands there. That we can go ahead and, uh, you know... Juka Naturalista. Okay, that is alright. You're attacking in. You are attacking in. The freaking mad lad. Okay. Alright. Maybe I should have done it after. No. But I'm still doing it right away. Still doing it right freaking away. Do you have another borrow time? Do you hear it? Do you freaking have it? They haven't touched the spirit realm. Okay. Alright. That is a-okay with me. That is absolutely a-okay with me. Because I do have the meat of Masker. So, hey. It is still fine, you know? Still freaking fine. The big score, though. Now we're keeping that. We're freaking keeping that. Alrighty. Wait, let's do it for three, just in case they do have a snakeskin veil. Just in freaking case they do. Alrighty. Oh, get out of here, my friend. Get freaking out of here. So, we're putting this one onto our uh, little wandering emperor here. And hopefully, hopefully... Oh, I forgot to push down the button. Okay, well, it doesn't matter. We're doing it. We're doing it now. Doesn't matter at all. Okay. Alrighty. So, we can now make this come in as a freaking citizen token. That is so good. <laughs> that is so good. And we're doing it. We're making it come in as a citizen token. Alright. So. <laughs> oh no! Please don't tell me it ain't so. Oh, are you now becoming a little citizen token? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> So we're still trying. We have enough life for everything, you know? We do have enough freaking life for everything. Alright, what are you getting rid of? My wandering emperor? Okay, that is totally fine with me. That is totally freaking fine with me. I don't mind it at all. I really don't. I really freaking don't. I just need to find, like, one thing that I like. You know, one single thing that I like. This ain't it, though. This ain't... Please don't give me two lands here. Please don't give me two lands. Well, it is almost two lands. It is almost two freaking lands. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Let's do it for four here. And, uh, you know, we're still doing things. We are still doing things. I just hope that uh, they have some way to gain life back, you know? Because otherwise, this, like, rebel reading here will just not give us ever the thing that I want the most, which is an Opnixili. Which is a freaking Opnixili. All I want is an Opnixili. All I freaking want is one. And I repeat, one of Nixali. Only freaking one, man. Give it to me, game. Give it to me. All right. Maybe they have their own wandering emperor. Who knows? They would be pretty darn good if they did. Okay. So we're drawing here. That is all I care about. Drawing a card. Get, hopefully getting an Nixali. <gasps> oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. Yes. Oh, my lord. Yes. Oh, my freaking lord. Yes. Okay, all right, all right, all freaking right. Okay, okay. So let us just hope they don't have another one of those. If they do, I will be very darn disappointed. Very freaking darn disappointed. So we're making the devil here. My goons will make quick work of you. Bringing down this. Oh, if they have another touch to spirit realm. Oh, if they do, I will be so sad. So freaking sad. They do have another one. They do. Okay. All right. That is okay with me. Plead for mercy. Oh, we are attacking in. Oh, my lord. Are we doing it? Are we freaking doing it? If they have a board wipe here, we'll also be disappointed. Oh, my lord. We're so close. 
We're so darn close. So freaking darn close, my friends. Oh, oh, we will at least get three of them, you know? We will at least get three of Nixalai. At least three. No! No! Oh, no! Oh, no! That is so unfair. I was so close of doing it. Why? Oh, dear Upek. You are so disappointing to me right now. Oh, get out of here. We were so darn close of doing it, but I cannot keep on trying, sadly. Sadly, it's time for me to just beat up Sparky here. All right. We do have the Doom Scar. That is okay. That is all we need here against Sparky. And we do have the two Mystic Reflections. So you will see where this deck goes. Okay. As long as we survive here, that is all that matters. And then we are freaking good. So. Sparky. Bring on the pain. I don't mind at all. I really don't. We have the Sunset Revelry even here. That is good. That gives me creatures and life. Okay. All right. I can sack one of those creatures. Alrighty. Opponent's going strong here. Opponent is going strong here. Come on, Sparky. <laughs> you should know better than that. You should know freaking better than that. Okay, we are in no danger of dying here. It's freaking Sparky. What do you even expect? What do you even expect? Okay. Alrighty. Once more. I'm okay here. It's just Sparky. Come on. Come on. I don't even care. I will just uh, get rid of the other Mystic Reflection. One Mystic Reflection is all that we need here. It is all we freaking need. Okay. And uh, with the big score I will be drawing here. I will just wipe the board here. I mean, hey, 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 hey. All that matters is that we get to the combo. And that is how you do it, you know? I just want to show you how you freaking do it. Okay. My turn. So we're going pretty strong here. I have to say. Uh, everything is still A-OK. -okay because we do have the Shambly Boy here into the rebel rousing next turn and we do have the big score we all we need now all we need now is two more cards and then we're good <laughs> well there is one of them there is freaking one of them now all right more freaking roddy that is super darn good i love it oh i don't have the mana for it i don't have the mana for it okay well i mean oh well well hey oh i don't know why i don't have the mana for it but it's okay but it's okay I, I will not cry about spilled milk, you know? So, we're so darn close. All we need now is the Luxior and we win the freaking game on the freaking spot. Right away. Right freaking away. Well, not winning, but we will finally get the combo now. Right away. Right freaking away. So. Wait. Let us do this first. There's not a rebel rousing. Yeah, let us see how many of those freaking Obnixili we can get, you know? How freaking many we can get. That is all I care for. Getting as many Obnixili as I can. Okay. Very darn good. Thank you very much, opponent. You're helping me out here and you don't even know how. Oh, little Sparky. Oh, little Sparky. So we're keeping the, uh, the big score here now. We're so close. We're so freaking close, my friends. All we need to do is to survive. And get freaking our one card that we still need here. Um, okay. All right. You do that. It was always allowed. Still no looks you're here. Still no freaking looks you're here. But hey, we're getting there. I promise you. We will do it today. We will freaking do it today. Okay. All right. Let's try to find a looks you're like this, maybe. You know, by making a lot of freaking creatures. Look, Jor, are you here? There it is. There it freaking is. Okay. So. We're making a lot of freaking creatures here now. That is super darn good. Alright, they're blocking here. That is super darn okay with Mayo. But we will be getting 10 creatures next turn. Oh my lord, finally, freaking finally. Oh no, we're not getting 10 creatures. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, but we are getting there, you know, that is all that matters. 
That is all that freaking matters. Yeah, you can have that. I don't mind, little uh, Sparky. I don't mind at all. Okay. So. Um, let's do this so we can make sure that we have the ten creatures ready to rock and roll in. And then we're finally freaking doing it, my friends. I had to beat up Sparky for this. But we didn't get it. We did not get it. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. <laughs> oh, my lord. Yeah, all we've got to do is to attack in with one here. All we've got to do is to attack in with one here. Oh, my god. Oh, my sweet lord. Are you attacking in here, Sparky? You are. The Madland. What is wrong with Sparky? I mean, yes, they do have lethal here, but still, that is like a super bad play. Just a super bad play. Okay. So, we will only attack in with one singular creature. One singular freaking creature. Then we still have ten, you know? I will even give him the chance to block it here. Alrighty. So, Luxure comes down finally. Freaking finally. Yes, why not? And Luxure, please. Thank you very freaking much. Oh, my sweet lord. So, are you blocking this? Sparky's blocking it. Perfect. Freaking perfect. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that wasn't even out that bad, Sparky. I have to give you that one. I have to freaking give you that one. All right. Um, we're in no danger of dying here. I'm still gonna get rid of this one here. Okay. So, we're finally here. It only took me six minutes with Sparky. Aw. Aw, indeed. Aw, in freak indeed. I'm sorry. So we have to put this one on the non-legendary, you know? That is very much important. And, uh... Are we doing this? I don't want him to die here. I really don't, and I don't want us to die. So we're ending the turn. And now we're making ourselves a bajillion freaking Opnicks alive. Ain't it beautiful? The answer is yes. Yes, it is. Finally. Freaking finally. Oh my god. Oh my sweet lord. They are attacking in. You can have that. I don't mind. I don't mind at all. Okay, my friends. After 45 minutes of trying, we can finally say that we did it. The most convoluted, crazy, freaking combo of all freaking times. So, are they dead if we attack in with everything here? Uh, we're attacking it with these and these. And with this as well. I mean, it doesn't matter. I just want to have a bajillion freaking up Nix alive here. Okay. <laughs> oh, finally, man. Finally. I really had to go to visit Sparky for that. And that, my friend, is how you make yourself 14. Freaking up Nixelai. Oh, I'm sorry, Sparky. I'm sorry. I am so darn freaking sorry, Sparky. But hey, I mean, hey, look at this. 14 freaking up Nixelai with the rebel rousing and everything. It is so darn freaking delicious. Oh, get out of here, Sparky. Get out of here. So yeah, we had to visit Sparky at the end, but it was totally worth it. I mean, hey, you know, we were so close to at least get three to four, but people just scooped. We beat them in other ways. It was amazing. As I said, the deck is not even half that bad by itself. But I really wish we could have pulled it off in the ranking queues. I mean, we were so darn close. So darn close. So, darn close. so yeah, it was amazing. But hey, Sparky got here, so that is also okay. Sometimes Sparky needs to do the things that other people aren't willing to do, like stay until the end, until, uh, you know, something happens. And maybe you are like Sparky, and you are staying until the end. So please, if you are, give me a Mystic Opnixili in the freaking comments down below, so I know that you're one of those very, very amazing people that stay until the end and watch me do all of the shtick until we're done. So hey, I really, really appreciate it if you are here, and I also really appreciate all of these beautiful people on this beautiful list. Thank you all so very freaking much. We even have some new people on here, and that is just freaking amazing. So from the bottom of my heart, 
thank you very freaking much. I really darn appreciate it. And if you want to check out the Patreon or the membership, get part of this list, you know, you can always check it out down below every single video. There's a link, there's a button, easy peasy, lemon freaking squeezy. But hey, always think of yourself first. There's other ways to support the channel, like subscribing. We are on our way to 15,000. 15 freaking thousand. And I won't achieve it until my birthday. Maybe that's going to be a little bit crazy because my birthday is in a little more than two weeks, but that's three weeks. Maybe we can do it. If you want to give me something, do that. Hey, I don't know. But up until then, remember that if you're waking up tomorrow morning and you see that beautiful, beautiful face of yours in the mirror, that all of you are pretty freaking sweet. I'm Max Malone, and I will see you all tomorrow.